believe that people have given over their power, their, their self-knowing about their bodies. Our bodies already know how to heal themselves. But we've become disconnected. People go to doctors, go to Western medicine, and have gotten used to just taking a pharmaceutical off the shelf and taking it for a headache or when they don't feel well. But the problem with that is, is that the more you take a medicine, a drug, the more your body begins to rely on it and forgets how to heal itself. It knows how, but then those very medicines get in the way. They interfere. They are in some ways a side effect of your natural healing ability. It's not that energy medicine replaces Western medicine. Western medicine is one of the most amazing developments that any culture has ever come up with. But when you bring the energies of the body in to meet with the understanding of physiology. You have a combination that really gets to the heart of illness, that really gets to the heart of healing. And so we're very excited to be bringing the energy dimension back into human healing. One of the things about energy medicine is that you come home to yourself. You get on your own rhythm. You start getting more and more vitality more and more aliveness and life becomes more exciting life becomes really something you can fall in love with because it is thrilling and empowering to know you can heal yourself in fact i am still doing this today because i know i need energy medicine i was very ill. I grew up with a lot of ailments from tuberculosis to being allergic to everything under the sun. I mean, there was very few things that I could eat. And, but by the time I was 16, I had multiple sclerosis that just got worse and worse over the years. And by the time I was 27, I had a heart attack. And, and that was about the same time that I lost more and more energy in my legs and couldn't walk very well and sometimes couldn't walk at all. All my organs were breaking down and, uh, and I had asthma. I could hardly walk outside without having an asthma attack. And I had five different specialists tell me that I wasn't going to make it, that I was not going to live. And each one of them told me a different amount of time that they felt I had. But something happened to me on that fifth doctor. And I, I thought, I'm going to heal myself. And I knew I was. And, I, and in some ways, it was the best thing that ever happened to me. And what is unique about her work is that she has figured out how to identify which of these nine systems is really needing attention and how they work together and getting them working in harmony with one another so that there is an assessment part and then there is a part where she has figured out very simple techniques for getting them all back into harmony and balance. Here's the program that we've designed for you. Session one teaches you a daily energy routine, a set of procedures that you can do in five or six minutes that if you do them every day, it's going to shift the energy habits in your body in a way that really makes a difference. So session two is about clearing, grounding, and centering your energies. Session three teaches you about your immune system. It teaches you about the fight or flight response so that you can really stay healthy and stay relaxed even amidst a great deal of stress. So session four is about using energy testing so that you can make healthy choices in vitamins, in your food, in perhaps even the jewelry you're wearing or the eyeglasses you're wearing. You can find out if the energy of those things vibrate with your own energies. Session five is about working with pain. A lot of people carry pain and they just learn to live with it. They try to ignore it or they take, they take something to try to suppress it. In energy medicine, you work with pain by going to the energetic roots of what's causing the pain and by shifting what's happening in those energetic roots, it begins to heal what the pain is all about.
Session six is about your chakra system. It's about clearing your past, opening up to the future, but also just making space in your chakras and learning about each one of them. Session seven is about the aura. The aura protects you, it surrounds you, but it also connects you with your environment. So to keep your aura really clean, to keep it balanced, gives you a lot more support from the energies that surround your body. Session eight is about your radiant circuits, plugging into your joy and vitality and passion and gratitude and sense of wonder and awe. If you learn these simple techniques and tools to help your body not only get healthier and more vital, but it it is no longer as susceptible to getting sick. It sort of evolves. It gets stronger and stronger so that you genuinely like getting older. And we live in a culture where people are afraid of aging. And this is a wonderful thing for that because you can have the energy you had when you were very young, when you are much older. This is going to be an amazing program and I really want you in on this course. Uh, I really invite you to come in. I invite you to open in a way that your energies will expand and you will feel empowered 